the Long Valley caldera ready to blow, scientists say. They're warning this massive supervolcano of California could release 140 cubic miles of material in its next eruption. And you'll see the ash cloud that has previously covered is almost as much as Yellowstone. So this is a very important warning. California volcano is ready to blow, scientists warn. Building to blow. This is the Long Valley caldera of California. It's not just Yellowstone that is ready to blow. We also have another old area, the Long Valley caldera, located in the area of California. It would take in California, Nevada, Arizona, New Mexico, Colorado, and Utah. Certainly hoping that they, all these states have evacuation plans, including filter masks to wear and emergency food and water. The way the Long Valley Volcano is acting, you might need this as soon as possible. When people think of California, they may think of earthquakes, but a lot of people don't know that there are volcanoes there as well. At least two, the Lassen Peak and the much larger Long Valley Caldera near Mammoth Lakes. In 1915, Lassen Peak erupted and wrecked a huge portion of the state of California. Now, over the last 100 days, the much larger Long Valley Caldera has been acting up. It's acting up with uplift, with earthquakes, and it's doing what geologists and the U.S. Geological Survey are calling concern. The caldera, the mouth of volcano, is moving. According to scientific instruments monitoring the area, the United States Geological Survey, that's the USGS, in the area in the vicinity of the Long Valley caldera, find that it is deforming and it's moving rapidly compared to previous records. Now, how sure are they this is happening? They're 95% confident, and the data assembled is significant. It shows that a recent time span, the amount of the movement is causing statistically significant strain in the rocks of the area. It is not a conspiracy theory or conjecture or amateur geological antics. This is from the USGS itself. This is the actual data. And uh, now if, if you can see it in the article I'll leave below for you. It, looks, it may look like gobbledygook to you, uh, but you're not alone. You can scroll down and understand the explanations. USGS instrument measurements. It says the following exceed SRN 1.5 and at the 95% CI, the assembly the, the assemble is significant. Time span is 31 out of 730 days. To be significant at the 95% CI counts need to be to exceed 20 units in either mm per year or nano strain per year. So uh, you can uh, be saved the trouble. All of the readings in the first data exceed the 20 units. Uh, the following units exceed NSR SNR 2.0 and at the 95% CI, the assemble is significant. This time span is 31 out of 700.
If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media, and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, and Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.